Apparently they have no idea how annoying that is. You fuck with it, don't care. Nice little chunk. See what? Yeah, he's pretty though. Nice little chunk. Sorry, I'm gonna have to give him a little bit of a lob. I don't normally do that, but a nice little piece of fish. Bye. Scooping bait spinner. No trailer, no nothing. Just salt, casting the trees, casting the trees. Now I've got fish. Um, first thing to have, yeah. I guess they like the center bait today. Oh, he swiped it and missed. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yes, center bait. Fat female spawned out. A little chunky monkey. Thank you. You went the wrong way. <laughs> Got me soaked. Come down here. Oh, shoot. Because that's three. Just leave the stuff there, it'll be fine. I don't know if that's the same fish or not, but either way. That's three. Please don't splash me. Please don't splash me. You splash me anyways.
was a soft shell turtle. Good lord. Him with, so you gotta do something. Another little chunker. Not, yeah. Mind if I, okay. I love King Charles Cavaliers. Yeah, she's, a little, she's really shy, so don't feel bad. Okay. She won't bite for sure, but she'll, she'll run off. She's certainly okay. You smell my puppies? <laughs> It's hard to tell. Um, I've caught some decent ones out here, but nothing over like three and a half. But I'm sure there's, there's still a few that are working. But they get smart, you know, the, most, the more fishing pressure that you have, the, the less likely they are to bite. Yep. Yep, thank you. Watermelon seed. Okay, they're still here, and they're still biting. Oh! What? Well, I can't get you out there. Bye. Okay. Hey, people. I just wanted to follow up real quick on the video. Sorry about the uh, GoPro quality, but my big camera that I just bought is malfunctioning, so I'm having to go with the next best thing. This has a decent quality with good pictures, so I hope it will suffice for this video. I want to apologize straight up. Sorry, technical difficulties. Don't know what in the world is going on with it. But anyways, I just wanted to follow up. I did not make a whole lot of edits to that video today that you saw right off the bat. Like when we got there, we literally walked up, we started fishing almost immediately, and I caught all of those. So when you see it go from like normal to fast motion, that's not me chopping chunks out of the video. Look at the timestamps that you see in the video, and you'll see that it was just like they were so close together. The first three were really, really close together. After that, it took a little bit. It was like I caught all those three really close together, and then they slowed down for some reason. I don't know why. The overcast gay, the, the overcast days, and uh, the warmer temperatures have really started to make them move up. So, as you saw in the video that I released yesterday um, about the creek, they've really they've even pushed up onto and started making beds there, which I wasn't expecting them to do this soon. But it looks like everything, at least pond-wise, the lakes are probably about doing the same thing. They're all pushing up and getting into the shallows. And I think that's why I caught them on the spinnerbait today. Now you, you saw in the video that Melissa was throwing the white and chartreuse um, chatterbait basically. It's the Guggenbait's version of it. Uh, it's called a clickbait. And she didn't get a single bite. And I even switched over to another uh, spinnerbait uh, that's similar to the Guggen Squad Zinger. And she couldn't get a bite either on that one. So, I just wanted to show you one more time. I know you saw it in the video. It's a Guggen Squad Zinger. You can see it's got a gold leaf and then silver willow leaf. White and chartreuse. A little bit of orange on the bottom. This was the, the ticket today. I don't know why it worked so well today, but it did. Um, I'm also throwing it on, as you can see, this is a Shimano SLX rod with a Shimano SLX uh, reel. This is not the, the DC, this isn't the real, real expensive, well, not real, real expensive for Shimano, but this is like the, the $70 reel, or maybe $100 reel. Um, it's not the 150 to 200 one, so it's got a, it, it sings. This thing has just been amazing, and this pair is awesome. I cannot say enough good things about it. Oh, the reel is the 150 HG, so I, I love this setup. And I will do more of a gear review on some of these things in my other part 
uh, my review playlist. So you might want to check that out when I get them up and going. And um, But I hope you enjoyed the video, and hope you look forward to the next one. Keep catching.